Well, we're pretty excited to have a uh, new giraffe born here at Niobe Zoo. Uh, it was born on Tuesday the 10th uh, at about 3.30 in the morning, actually. So we uh, came in at about 7 to check on Mimi, uh, his mom, to see how she was doing, and we had found that a, uh, that a baby had been born. So we had been watching her closely because uh, we knew she was pregnant and knew, knew that she was due any day now. So um, we came in a little early, and sure enough, uh, the baby had finally been born. So we were very happy to see that. And, it uh, seems like he's uh, healthy and doing well. We had a, had a vet exam with him uh, right after he was born and came out with flying colors, so we're, we're thrilled. Yeah, he seems to be uh, a, little, a little more willing to strike out on his own. Uh, it's only been a few days. Uh, a lot of times our, our giraffe babies have, have kind of stay hiding behind mom and those sorts of things until they feel a little more comfortable, but he's only been born for a couple of days, and he seems pretty willing to, to kind of keep to himself and he doesn't necessarily uh, you know follow around mom's hip like some of the other ones have after only a couple days. Uh, he's, this baby is about five and a half feet tall. We've had babies that are upwards of six feet tall so he's he's kind of right there in that range and we've also had babies that are about five feet tall so he's kind of square in the middle and he uh, at birth weighed 107 pounds uh, so it's definitely a big baby and that's one of the reasons that we love having giraffe babies here at the zoo because it's a great opportunity for us to educate the community about these amazing babies and how different they are compared to a human baby or you know some of the other baby animals they may have come across in their lives. You're not going to find anything like a giraffe baby just just because of the size and the fact that they're up and walking in a couple hours and you know they just look so much different and uh, it's a great opportunity to teach everyone about the life cycle of a giraffe. Uh, it takes a couple hours for them to stand after they're born. Uh, they usually when they're born they lay for a while, kind of get their bearings. Uh, mom usually will help them uh, kind of come around and kind of nudge them and lick them and, and, uh, and, and get them stimulated and awake. And then after a couple hours, they'll try and stand for the first time. And usually it takes a few attempts uh, to get their legs underneath them. And, but uh, only after you know four or five hours, they're up and moving about.